Seminole County says it's landed a state grant to help fund three county projects intended to reduce flooding. The bulk of the money for the Midway community, which he's has experienced flooding issues for years. West News Day McDaniel looks at what improvements are in the plan. After Ian, right after the bridge, we had sheet flow across uh, Missouri Avenue here, and it was all the way into our neighborhood down in Beacon Drive. Tom Holler sent us this video of his Northwest Seminole County neighborhood from last fall. Happy to hear that replacing the Nebraska Avenue Bridge is one of three flood control projects included in the nearly $11 million grant Seminole County just landed. It's a good thing. The bridge is getting pretty darn old and uh, definitely needs replacement. It was less than a month ago when the Midway community was again slammed with rain, showing the historic issues with drainage there. Midway residents have been saying that their stormwater system is years out of date. This project should bring them a more modern system, one that is a better performer. The residents of the area are very uh, excited about the project because it is going to help correct a long-standing problem. Midway will get more than seven million of the newly awarded grant. The projects in final design and construction may begin by the end of next year. You're going to see water leave, storm water leave the neighborhood quicker and you'll also see a reduction in the flooding depth during uh, heavy rain, rain events. It's critical in terms of building the basic infrastructure so that when it rains, this, the community is still functional. A county commissioner who's worked hard to improve the stormwater system in Midway says getting easements from property owners is critical. An effort failed years ago when the county could not get enough resident cooperation. And we have the commitment from the local community organizations to get easements. If the easements don't come, the whole thing grinds to a halt again. She's hopeful this plan succeeds. In Seminole County, Dave McDaniel, West 2 News.